I don't remember names very well or openings. Right. So I should definitely. I, you I'm do gonna, have a few of your favorite positions. Yeah, I, I, I can write that down for my Tinder Tinder yep. portfolio. <laughs> <laughs> All right, rookie two. Yeah, Wesley. Wait, no, there, there is the combo here. Queen takes f two. He just missed it. Oh, a highlightable moment. Ooh, queen takes f two. That's right. Just blundered Never. it. Rook c two. Queen takes f two. If White takes it, Rook d one was mate and bake. Everybody. Oh, oh, that's sick. And he's got knight g three. Oh, jeez, that is. Uh... <laughs> If someone doesn't clip that moment and help that thing go viral, I, there's nothing more I can do for you. All of our fans here, please clip the last 45 seconds, 30 seconds of that game because that was bananas. Um, Eric, <laughs> I'm sorry. That was that was just it was crazy. No, we did not expect Wesley in, in, in that form falling for some of these motifs that we've all seen quite a bit, but you do, you know, one out of 100 games fall for it. And that yep. was that one of – and that is – Unfortunately, he's on the wrong side of a highlight reel there. Yeah. Queen takes f2, and the knight g3 rook, uh, rook h5. Uh, is it, you yeah, and I, the, you the, and I love when our when our inappropriate uh, directions of the conversation become relevant because in that situation, uh, Wesley did not have one of his favorite positions, and it ended up being a puzzle book mate. I mean, that was seriously queen takes f2, knight g3. Somebody put it in tactics trainer. That is going to be in tactics trainer. Um, All right. Well, Wesley. Well, Wesley's got to shake it off. You said vintage. Wesley is, is wins and draws, and that yeah. was that was the kind of game you don't want to have happen. But that's why it's blitz. You know, it, it was the kind of game. At least you're in Wesley's shoes right now. Before you were like, how do I beat Magnus? How do I do it now? That loss you attribute to yourself. I blundered. Maybe I was getting a little too, yeah. you know, optimistic. But at least that's in his control. When the real tilt happens, when you're like, how do I beat Magnus Carlson? Like the guy just gives me no room. Right now, at least yeah. it's in his control. If he takes it the right way, I think he can recover here. Appreciate. And White, he's got a great position. White Phoenix great. and uh, Love Chess for subscribing. Appreciate it. Uh, all right. Well, now now we're back to something a little more tame, a little less. Well, this is going to be. This is actually very. It's interesting. It is tame, but it's very very uh, important in this specific position that Black plays f5 f4 because otherwise his five pawns on the king side. Are sort of useless in any games. They're very hard to push. They sort of block his own bishop. White would be playing c4, knight c3, knight d5, and taking over, playing around yeah. that formation. The only reason this formation could be good is in the middle game with an attack. So yeah. Wesley has to attack this game, and I'm expecting fireworks. I'm expecting that form. I'm expecting teams on the board because the end game is not going to be good. Those double pawns are just White's just going to leave them there yep. and say I have a queenside majority. Yep. Yeah. Fantastic. Uh, educational points there by Eric Black needs to be all in here because the structure greatly favors white if we head to an endgame. So Magnus is going to try to put the kibosh on that with g3 to over protect f4, but you don't, f4 is going to come anyway. It doesn't matter what you do to stop f4 because, as you said, Eric, he doesn't really have a choice. And here it comes. He's going for it. That's good. No, I like it though. At least that, that yeah. I think that was the right read of this position. Uh, and his bishop is going to c8. And going to uh, some money squares, uh, yeah. h3, g4, uh, all, all inclusive. Uh, maybe you throw in a move like king h7 here if you want to be real prophylactic. Uh, just avoiding a, any pins and, and getting off the back rank. Uh, other, Ooh. Okay, so knight c1. Got to be knight c1, the knight's trapped. So you're down two pawns, but you got attack. I, I'm not sure I would have done that. But he, if you're going to do that, you're really banking on mate because you've just closed off your rooks. You're really banking on the fact that you can maybe play queen g4, followed by rook h5, followed by rook h5, uh, sorry, rook f5, followed by rook h5. Mm -hmm. All those light squared ideas. He's really banking on, on mate here. Before, at least, he could open up the f file. Now it's, now it's all in. The, what, yeah, what, I what I can it do felt like is there get was the maybe a more patient approach there from black, but. Uh... It, you know, it's definitely all in, right? White has everything yeah. that you would ever need to win a game over here on the queen side, and so it'll be whether Magnus can defend the mating net. He's, he gets the queen on f1. Look, I'm going to put my bishop on c8 and try to play bishop h3, bishop g2, mm -hmm. and do some sort of queen sack. Uh, what's he doing here? Interesting. Bishop. Oh, bishop a6. He wants ah. to stop the queen from getting a6. I would play queen f1 now, and if bishop a6, I would play c4. Followed by B three, and at least my queen gets the F one. Oh, this is this is a critical game here. The, the yep. players are going for it. Um, rook, rook G six threatening queen takes H four. The G pawn is pinned. 
Queen eight, King H two might might be a solution here. Although then then maybe Bishop C eight Queen Queen G four is an idea, or Rook G four Rook takes H four. This is this is serious. Magnus does need to do something urgent. Actually, I, I don't think he can maintain this. Rook takes G three and F two check is also uh, in the air. In, in the air. This is this is very dangerous. Magnus has to has to sacrifice back, trade off pieces. But I'm starting to think that Wesley this is a position. Yep. Yeah, yep. Yeah. He goes King H2, but now it's Rook G4 okay. played real quickly. If Queen F1, Bishop C8, and I want to do Rook takes H4, G H4, Queen H4, bring my other Rook and just deliver a checkmate on the G file. So Bishop, Queen, Queen F1, Bishop C8, I think, is a move that he may have underestimated. Bishop C8. Bishop, Bishop C8, C8, C8 here, and Rook takes H4. And then you bring the other Rook to the G file. Yeah. Problem is, this Knight on C1, what is it doing? Nothing. It's way the too slow. The board is so cut in, half, cut in half. Black could even play G5 here. Black has time to do... Mm -hmm. Right to, yep. to to pry open. Okay, he goes for bishop c8 as you said. But... This is this is yeah. And now and now. Um... Oof. Here he goes. He found the combination. He Rook found takes it. h4. He found it's it. over. The king the king can't run to f1, Daddy, because there is bishop, bishop to a6. a6 check. Look at so how nasty king, that Rook... is. Oof. Bishop a6. And now you keep the pin. Wait a second. Now he needs to. Yeah, think. you don't even need to do it. Play rook d8 even, right? Play yeah, rook d8. d8 and this, gang up this. on it. Yep, and he finds it. Wow. No, this was. This now was, he could. Now he could take with the bishop and take just, with the bishop and just go into the end game. Yeah, yeah. Um, because the king is still stuck. Well, again, we already know. We've been highlighting that yeah. Wesley So has persevered very recently. Very he, impressive he, so he far. Lost, he lost a crazy game that was highlightable about five minutes ago, and guess what? Well, he just he, he just returned the favor. Now Magnus. Let's Carlson. talk about how Black converts this. Okay. Because he still needs that little push. Uh, do you try to play Queen to C two? Do you try to put your you know Queen D three check? Uh, Queen White's D three, Rook D six, maybe. Queen D three, Rook D six, and flip back to the king side. I kind of like that. Queen d3 check, king g1, rook d6, I'll play king h2, maybe you have queen e2. Okay, that seems like it's winning. He needs to, yeah, that's... No, you're right, I like though. That. I guess I was jumping the gun. The highlight reel isn't fully submitted yet, because if Wesley doesn't convert this properly, Magnus might wiggle his way into a drawn rook. So f8. now he has an alternative, or maybe he plays like rook f8, rook f4, uh -huh. or here gets his queen to e2. Should be winning. He just needs to watch out for perpetual. So queen g4. Uh, there's, I don't even know. There's no perpetual here. Yeah, this is this is uh, this is going to be. We're going to see a resignation fairly. Oh, he's even got soon. queen takes f2 so, coming with so, mate. So the so rook, if rook g1 can be taken. What you do after I've been all around the globe trying